Hey, what are you doing there? I am gardening. Look at my garden the way it is all overgrown. You're all wrong. You can stop, stop, stop. Give me that hoe. Let me see that hoe. Oh my god. Look, stop doing this. You know what I'm gonna do with that hoe? This here doesn't work. Throw that crap away. Nowadays nobody uses a hoe anymore. And how do we go about getting rid of all this weeds here? With the hoe we suffer a lot. I'm going to teach you a tip, a trick that I learned from a farmer, he taught me the right way to clear the bush without using a hoe. It's a very simple tip. What is it there? I'm going to put some water here. The owner of the ranch taught me there and killed all the weeds on his property. I'm going to get it here, a spoon of salt. The salt will help to have a chemical reaction that the weeds cannot support. So, the people at the farm today no longer use toxic products or hoes. So they use these techniques that the internet itself teaches nowadays. Check it out here, it's a recipe that is tested and approved in practice by the site staff. Wow, very nice. Look, six spoons of salt. That's enough? It's enough. You see, the weed can't stand this chemical reaction. And none of those pests that invade the garden, which is in front of people's houses. Sometimes there are many people who have a lot of weeds in front of their house, and the land is not theirs, and they don't know how to do it. So what do they do? They can make a little mix like this here. Go there and use it. The next day, the bush that was there in front of their houses will be all dry. Look, I'm going to put a six scoop amount of detergent here. Ah, so we put the six spoons of salt and six spoons of detergent. That's six spoons of salt and six spoons of dish soap. And about a liter of water. A liter of water more or less. I know this bowl here has a liter. So I'm going to make this mixture now. And to apply it is very easy. It's no big deal. The cool thing about this tip is, as I told you, you put it on today, and tomorrow, there's no weeds. Tomorrow, the bush will be all dry. And you will no longer need a lawnmower to clean your yard. And you won't even need to pick up the hoe. Too easy. A little mix that will help a lot to the staff. And it's ready, is that all? It's ready, that's all. And look at the secret here. This here is a tip. This is the right way to use it. You can use a pump or the water bottle itself. If you are going to use it in the bottle, you take off the cap, make several holes here with a nail. And when the liquid is in here, you get to the plant and put it like this. But since I have a bomb, I am certainly going to use it. It's more practical, right? Exactly. Look, I have the pump here, I have the mixture here. I've mixed it well, right? And you can see that it's already causing a reaction because it's already giving a foaming effect here, see? Yeah. How am I going to do it? It's simple, there's no secret. I put it in there. Let's fill her entire reservoir. Filled up, look. I put the lid on, it's very simple. This tip here is the best tip that has ever been tested to kill weeds. This is a homemade product, it's not toxic right? So you don't have to buy poison in agriculture, you don't have to suffer with hoe in hand anymore. Contaminating the soil. This here doesn't contaminate nature, and the cool thing about this is that it ends very quickly with pests. So you come here, for example, I see that your garden has a chicory, look, there's a chicory here. It's overgrown around, your strawberry is overgrown around. So what do you do? You come in the dots, you see the steam, the steam that comes out, look. Come here, it spreads well, see how it sprays? Yeah. The smoke comes out. It's full. So this here is the secret that landowners, ranch owners, use to get rid of the bush. Come here to show you, look at this here. I just passed here, it's already withering. Look, the effect is practically immediate. You can see? Yeah. The leaves are already wilting, and they are all shrinking. And this tomorrow will all be dead. There will be no more green grass in front of your house. Look, you can deviate from your plantations and apply it only in the bush. There's only one detail, you have to apply this on the day when it's not raining, right? Only with hot sun, with good weather, because if it rains, the rain itself washes the product that is in the bush. It has to take effect, 
he has to give it a little time to take effect, you know? Everyone uses this here on their properties, and it solves the problem. Oh right, the best tip I've ever seen. Are you going to keep using hoe, or are you going to use this here? Oh no, that hoe I already threw away, I don't even want it anymore. I'll tell you something, if you're going to depend on clearing brush, you're going to starve. This here is much easier.